Daz Dillinger had a lot to say when Suge Knight went to jail, and I don't blame him. He had his own issues with Suge Knight, and they went back and forth for years, lawsuits, uh, a lot of violence with Suge Knight, and Daz was always one of the more outspoken members of the Dog Pound, more respected mem- Well, he was just respected. All of them were respected, but... uh you know, Daz has done his thing, man. He's been in hip-hop a long time, made a lot of money in hip-hop, and still making money in hip-hop, and that is respected. But Bosco had something to say about this. Bosco, okay? I like Bosco's commentary, but eh, this was a little weird. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that bell and the subscribe button. And if you want to add to the channel, it's jordantowmedia at gmail.com. Leave comments below. Tell me what you guys think. Even the hater comments, I'll read them all. Okay, so... Bosco reacted to Daz Dillinger saying flag on the play, blah, blah, blah. We're not, you know, you can't be, you weren't talking like this when Suge was out. And, you know, you shouldn't be wishing another man to go to jail, all that kind of stuff. Well, uh, Daz Dillinger caught one to this and reacted to it. Now, Bosco does all his videos in his crib just to be, you know, he's not going up to people and saying the things he says either. So you can't be hypocritical in the situation. Okay. Uh you know, but, you know, Bosco's Bosco. Bosco's funny. I'll give him his props on that. You know, I like I like Bosco's commentary sometimes. He's funny. Uh, let me know what you guys think about it. Here's the, uh, here's the response um, that Daz did in this whole thing. And, you know, check it out. Appreciate you watching. Peace. Daz. You know what I'm saying? I'm the enforcer of the dog pad, nigga. All them other niggas. I'm doing nothing, nigga. Just me and Nate Dog, C Style, and some more shit. You know what I'm saying? Big Trade E, you know, shit like that. But as far as you, Bosco, you know you done fucked up, right? You know you done fucked up. Yeah, nigga. I'm gonna take it back to that, nigga, and I don't give a fuck who care or who like it, nigga. I'm tired of y'all slob ass niggas. You know what I mean? Yeah, I said it, nigga. I'm tired of you slob-ass niggas. Point blank. Shout out to Big U. Shout out to all the Crips out there. You know what I'm saying? Let's get back to the essence of the shit, man. You know what I mean? All this goofy-ass bullshit. Bosco just sitting in somebody's living room. You rent, nigga. You never had nothing, nigga. Go and pay that rent, nigga. Them first is coming up, nigga. You better not be late, nigga. Get your page shut down, nigga. You won't make no money. And I went to Bosco House by myself, nigga. You know what I'm saying? No security, no nothing, nigga. I went in there, smoked a blunt with him back in the days. Don't know what happened. But that makes it better for me because you can't trust a slob-ass nigga like that. You know what I mean? So, I like whooping niggas. Catching them slipping. And the whole nine. I'm paid. I ain't got to go nowhere and do all that type of shit. Oh, I need to go try to make this money, this money, money for the four feet, all that other shit. I'm going to hold the bag up and let you come get it. And then when you come get the bag like a little rat for that cheese, that motherfucking trap come down on you. But that's all I got to say right now.